Welcome to IGM Guru. IGM Guru is one of the global leading online training and certification provider for IT expert by the skilled IT gurus to help them achieve their professional goals. Uh, Siddharth, uh, I have total eight plus years of experience and since four and a half years I'm working on various tools, uh, especially in RPA, machine learning and AI. Um, I worked on UiPath, Blue Prism, Automation Anywhere, AWS, Amazon AWS, IBM Watson, Python, and I worked for domain of BFS, Insurance, HR, Healthcare, as well as Telecom. Um, apart from this, I do uh, conduct the training, uh, you know, not only in India but abroad as well. Uh, so we do have a corporate. Uh, I have also done the corporate training, which is the uh, you know, in for the Tech Mahindra, uh, LNT for Mumbai. Uh, Tech Mahindra was in the Singapore, Maybank in Malaysia. So apart from this training, uh, online and offline with the car and the corporate, uh, I also provide the uh, you know workshops uh, where uh, it's a free. Sometimes it's free. Sometimes it's a two to three days. So we conduct the you know on Delhi, NCR, uh, Bangalore, Hyderabad like this. Um, apart from this, yes, I have uh, all the certifications from the UI path level one to. Four, along with the AWS and even from the Blue Prism and automation in as well. Uh, so let's quickly go ahead uh, to the next slide. Uh, of course, we need to understand your introduction, but uh, you the you have the problem, so I will move ahead. Uh, so before understanding RPA or before understanding the UI path, you need to understand what is the process automation. So process automation is nothing but a uh, software where you put your data um, which you can uh, use it for your organizational purpose, business purpose, for example SAP, CRM, mainframe, these are the applications which are called as a process automation because it is a paperless work which we need to do, which we do generally. Uh, Earlier of this process automation, there was a paperwork or some organization uses maintain the Excel notepad like this. Uh, so there is no harm to use it or there is no anything uh, which we cannot do. But yes, there are some challenges when we work on it. For example, what are the challenges we face while working? Uh, so if I'm working on a mainframe, I require a professional who understands the mainframe. If I'm working for a SAP, I required, of course, a person who knows the SAP. But when I say working, it doesn't mean for development. It's just adding to your data. CRM, I just want to add my data uh, for my customer data, Salesforce CRM. So there is a quality issue while adding, while mainframe, while doing connecting with the mainframe database. There is, might be, a, I need to get some detail of the insurance uh, or any account detail. For SAP, I need to un Install, uh, you know, I need to update the employee details in success factor. So there are a lot of tools available in the market and these widely used by organization. Every organization has SAP, mainframe and the CRM. Apart from this, there are a lot of other process automation tools available. So this is, these are the something process automation. Now only word is added which is called robotics process automation which is nothing but RPA. So what is process uh, robotics process automation? Robotics process automation is nothing but a software robot, a robo or RPA bot. What it does or what is the definition of the robot or robotics process automation? So the RPA is nothing but which mimics the human behavior, not human intelligence. It is just a rule-based repetitive task which we do on SAP, on CRM, on Salesforce, on mainframe application, on web, app, web application, on Windows application, on Excel, on PDF, on databases, whatever we do on daily basis that has we can automate using the RPA tool or any RPA tool. So RPA is nothing but which mimics the human behavior and which works on a rule based task on daily basis i want to do something okay for example if i talk about the example 
so see this is a login to the gmail or any email account i want to download some attachment for example say it is a data of invoice processing and i will store that attachment and those invoices i will add into the sub sap success factor or sap application so here on daily basis i'm getting one excel file or one csv file i'm doing it which is taking too much time and of course there is a quality issue because i'm copying and pasting so doing this this is one simple example there is a lot of examples in your bfs insurance healthcare and your hr department so this is something a rule based which i do one operation guy one uh, data entry guy do on every day on daily basis that something we can mimic or we can automate that using the rpa tool so there are two types of bot when we talk about the robots and the bot one is back office another one is the front office so basically back office is nothing but you don't need to provide any input to the bot bot works independently behind the scene whereas front office you need to provide some inputs which on the basis of your input bot will work or software robot bot is nothing but your rpa processes so here i have given one uh, thing here so your rpa bot is nothing but the combination of your process which you develop in ui path or blue prism or any tool rpa tool and when you execute or when you schedule or when you run it on a particular machine whether it's a virtual machine or a physical machine then i can call it as a bot okay now <clears throat> what is the characteristics of the bot uh, or rpa especially uh, so for developing the processes when i say developing it doesn't mean you need to write a code this is something you need to create a flow chart using the activities in ui path so it works on the presentation layer as i told you no coding required you can create a non intrusive automation as well as you can create a automation app um benefits it is of course a low manpower cost eliminates the error because there is no human interaction it is a future proof you can apply your rpa bot to any organ uh, any use case and if you tomorrow you want to give some sort of brain you can convert it into a cognitive rpa or ai and the main important part is your rpa bot doesn't eat it will not be in a sleepy mode it will not do the mistakes and it works 24/7 and without any uh, burden and it works faster than a human so we do have a various kpos vpos it data uh, data entry operation uh, claim processing uh, bank credit card uh, processing so you know finding the civil score or whatever so these are some manual tasks which we are doing on the on the daily basis in an organization so that is something we can automate and this is just rpa matrix for example if manually if it is taking 3 minute for a record whatever it may be it is uh, maybe a customer in processing invoice processing employee data whatever now using the rpa bot i can do in 15 second and because there is no average waiting time because we don't need to wait on a person and of course the quality may also increase so this is a general overview of how the process done manually using three people on three different machines they are working one is window another is pen main them third one is the sales force instead of a three human or three people i can have one single human sorry a software bot or robot which can work independently so i am saving the three people cost in my organization so this is all about the rpa how it uh, you know what is the rpa and characteristics and this is a talk of the town if you heard about the uh, infosys layoff cognizant layoff yes this is a fact why i required a manual tester or tech support guy who just doing the same thing on daily basis or a uh, you know a kpo guy or operation guy or any inventory guy any purchase details guy why i required these are the low skill jobs i would say 
and if you see this is a research there will be 6.4 lakh low skill jobs will not be there by 2021 so these are the all research you can google it yes because of rpa there is a uh, various lack of jobs because i don't require the human i will take it, my bot will take care of everything and these are the roles and industry on high risk yes bpo kpo e-commerce insurance which has a final financial analyst uh, your journalist manufacturing workers insurance underwriters claim pro representative who is processing your claim tester manual tester what manual tester does they do create a test script and they just manually do it out of i'm not saying out of 10 people will get replaced by what but 10 manual tester i can replace with out of 10 i can replace eight tester with the bot two tester will be there to create a test script rest of the thing my bot will take care and that is the reason if you want to survive in IT industry, especially when we are in the, uh, you know, India where service based companies are more as compared to product based, we have to have a niche skill in our resume. We have to upskill, reskill in new technology like RPA machine learning, IoT, blockchain. So this is a visualized with example uh, where a how the RPA works on RPA works on every data, any database, any file, any application, any type of files, its image, who it's maybe the image, your PDF, XML, text, HTML, Word. And that is the reason because of it is growing so fast. Hence, there are a lot of opportunities in RPA. So when I say RPA, it is not, not only a development, I require a developer, I require a tester, RPA tester, I require a I, RPA PA, I require a RPA manager, RPA lead, RPA uh, director, RPA support, controller, these are all profiles which are knocking to you because this is a robotics era. This is a 2020 will be the era of the robots where you can see around your all the robots chat pod, whether you are calling with the customer care on the telephone, you will find that, okay, this is not a guy. This is something a robot is speaking with you every everywhere. And these, these are the use cases which I was talking that every organization has this use cases for example, HR onboarding, when you onboard, you will provide your all the details like, uh, you know, scan documents. Your data will go to the admin department, payroll department, PF department. Who sends it? Someone behind the scene who is working on it, who is sending, who is actually adding your data, right? Somewhere in the, sound, in the system, maybe your SAPS success factor, maybe their own portal. So why I required a man, a HR who is working on it, I will create, I will add my bot and it will take care. Similarly for financial services, requesting for overdraft, draft, uh, credit card applications, uh, in insurance there is a claim processing, application, <coughs> application processing, in healthcare patient registration, these are all are use cases. And these are all the RPA tools available in the market. Well, so UiPath is a leading and topmost tool and then Blue Prism and Automation Anyway, these are the three which is leading in the market currently. And apart from we have a Work Fusion, OpenSpan, you know, IP Soft, and there are a lot of others as well. So this is a just a distribution with the tool. And how to start? You just need to learn one tool which you need to start with the simple basic example then the complex and then advisory uh, what are the prerequisites i require i need to learn the rpa you don't need a programming background if you have that is additional advantage okay you just need to understand the flow diagram how it works and you just need to understand the business process how the healthcare works how the uh, insurance domain work, how uh, the financial BFSI domain works like this. Um, apart from this, you don't require anything. And who can learn? Of course, 
who wants a white collar job especially test engineer manual tester because after a year you will not find the testing jobs trust me this is a fact this is a uh, no bitter truth that there will be no job because whatever i can do with the bot why should i have hired a tester and anyone wanting to save reduce the errors give the you know faster data processing i'm talking about the organization they can learn the rpa so this is a just a robotics process automation above and if i go for rpa tool so because we are here for a ui path so if you see this is the kind of a flow chart so this is one small example where it opens a desktop this application it reads the csv file and it add a data so let me quickly run this so you will understand how the ui path or any bot how it works so this is my bot is working my bot is running so it is open the application it is logging to that application it is you know clicking on the order button i am not doing anything it is adding one then click on also this is some steps okay this is some steps so this is a product detail it is adding it is quantity then account then it will click on submit and if you see this right hand side output you will find the log so this is adding one record after another so right now i have added the five records so it will run for five times tomorrow if i have 1000 records it will add that if i have 10000 it will process for one record max it will take 30 second if i go for manually it may take 3 to 4 minutes this is such a simple one example i do have a use cases where human required 2 to 3 hours to create to process one record for insurance domain for bfs domain where my bot is bot actually is doing within a 15 minutes one record so ultimately i am saving my cost i am saving my time and i'm doing so this is how it works see order data has been uploaded successfully and this is my bot uh, which gives me the message saying i have done my work so this is a flow how it looks this is a read csv where we are reading the file okay these all are activities in ui path there are more than 400 activities this is a ui path version 2019 community edition free of cost available and if you go for a main flow chart after reading i am going a centris data which is nothing but my windows application my i'm opening i'm logging to that so this is how screenshot gets maintained how bot identifies and for each record from that csv file i'm adding the record and at the end it is open the notepad and it will write this thing so this is small sweet example how it works now there are a lot of things uh, ui path added like a computer vision Uh, which is related with the, your surface automation there are a lot of recordings are available to uh, just record your manual flow and it, next time onwards your bot will work so it contains the activity there are a lot of activities here uh, so this is some project it will create this is you will get a output like this how uh, how your bot has worked this is the reference number it's been completed so this is the ui path community edition which is free of cost lifetime you can create n number of processes you can run it and there is a certification also which is free of cost and if you go for a certification one certification which has a level 4 will be available free of cost till 31st december after that it may be Uh, it will not get extended but it will be a 1 dollar 150 or 100 uh, dollar 100 will be the charges for this certification what why i am saying because you have a 15 days you can go through of course we do have a dumps for this we will provide you the dumps for ui path level 4 certification which is advanced and the last one if you have this you actually know everything about the ui path it means that and that is the reason when we provide a training on this ui path tool we are confidently say that you can show or you can 
uh, you will get at least of six months experience kind of things when you go this go for this workshop because whatever we are doing in our organization same thing we are showing to you nothing is different only difference is that the target applications may vary because I cannot give the SAP for organizational usage uh, which I use for organization I cannot use for this there will be a dummy applications but the concept the scenarios will be the same so this is all about from my end um, uh, thank you so much for joining and thank you so much for uh, you know for your time uh, if you have any questions please let me know thanks for watching the video for full course please visit www.igmguru.com and enroll today.